Hi, this is Jeremy from Video Gamers Oasis speaking. Make sure to follow my Twitch channel, https colon forward slash forward slash triple w dot twitch dot tv forward slash video gamers oasis and chat with me while I'm streaming. Video Gamers Oasis presents Video Game Handbook Reading with Professor Jerome. Oh, hello, welcome. Welcome back to Video Gamers Oasis presents Video, ga hand video Game Handbook Reading with Professor Jerome, book reader, bookology researcher. Welcome back to the show. This is a special Twitch broadcast of the show. Uh, just so, so you know, this video is being streamed on Twitch as I'm recording this. But you can also see, see an edited, uh, polished version of this video broadcast on my YouTube channel, Video Gamers Oasis. Make sure to click uh, the subscribe button on my YouTube channel, Video Gamers Oasis, and make sure that bell is wiggling. I'd be very grateful if you would do that for me. Uh, Streamlabs OBS, so I'm kind of getting my feet wet as we go along. I've got lots to learn. I've got new headphones. I'm a little transparent as you can see here. I've still got some solidifying to do. So I apologize for the quality of the video. I'll be learning uh, and getting better equipment in the future. Better green screen. Better. Uh, I'll be doing a better process of uh, green screen video in the future. Welcome back. Um, if you're watching my Video Gamers Oasis uh, YouTube channel, you've noticed I have a show called Video Gamers Oasis Presents Video Game Handbook Reading with Professor Jerome, which is me. And then on that show, I read various video game handbooks, as well as uh, documentaries, uh, some fictional, but mostly document uh, educational books about video games. And in this series, first series, uh, part of the series, we'll be reading the, we have been reading the Minecraft Construction Handbook, by Egmont, Egmont Books, and what will we be doing basically, my mustache keeps falling off, I'm going to reassemble that one, what we will be doing, we've been reading the Minecraft Construction Handbook, and our, my last episode, if you watched me on YouTube, uh, I, what I did was <clears throat> read the chapter on how to build a galleon ship in Minecraft, and it was a step-by-step -step process, eight steps in total to build a galleon ship. And I read the book, but I also showed you how to build a galleon ship. It was a very complicated, one of the most difficult projects I've done yet with the Minecraft Construction Handbook. So what we're doing in this episode, we're doing a very uh, relatively easy-going episode. It's just uh, two chapters of reading some community, community creations. We're reading community creations on the, in the Minecraft Construction Handbook. Pages 64 to 67. And their first one will be Made Ships by Fire UK. And the next chapter will be uh, Pirate Island Ship by Heaven underscore Lord. These are very brief uh, chapters, so they won't take much of your time. So I encourage you, though, uh, take your favorite beverage, pour it in a glass, like I am going to do so with some ice cold Brita water. I have a little sip of water there. <sighs> very refreshing. Very, very indeed. Very refreshing indeed. Now, we'll continue with our reading, the Blind Cut Construction Handbook. Starting with page 64, Mage Ships by Fire UK. And you can follow along if you have the book yourself. Just follow along as I read. Otherwise, on YouTube, it will be edited and you'll be able to see the graphic on the upper part of the screen. But that, that goes without saying. That's pretty well superlative. Page 64. Mage Ships. Excuse me. I had a little bit too much salsa and nachos there. Mage Ships by Fire, UK. These 
these mage ships were built by fire, UK, as part of the mage city. The sails have been created in different ways to give a more elegant, majestic feel to these vessels. And on the bottom of the page, page 64, you'll see a tips to take from this build. There's a little green background with a book symbol. And it reads, experiment with sail designs. It'll really make a difference to the overall look of your ship. Moving on to page 65. With these ships still, well, pardon me, <clears throat> while these ships still use wood for the hull and white wool for, for the sails, the main difference is the triangular side sails that span the entire length of the ship. Three of these sails stretch along the ship and create a very different look from other ships of similar scale and style. So we see the illustration from page 64 to page 65, a mage ships, mage ship. And I suppose these are the ships that mages would use in a mage city. So there you have a beautiful illustration. There's an idea, perhaps some Minecrafters out there on Twitch will, or YouTube would like to model their project after this one. Now we're moving on to page 66 for the final chapter. Today's video has been sponsored by Pi Network. Pi is a new digital currency developed by Stanford PhDs with over 8 million members worldwide. I'm sending you one in. To claim your Pi, follow this link https colon forward slash forward slash mine epi dot com forward slash video gamers oasis and use my username video gamers oasis as your invitation code we're moving on to page 66 for the final chapter of our episode pirate Island ship by heaven underscore Lord. Page 66. Here we go. Minecrafter heaven underscore Lord and his team created a huge, a huge pirate island with various ships of different sizes and styles. This is one of the ships found in the waters around Pirate Island. The hull was built out of yellow and black wool as an interesting alternative to the standard brown wooden hulls we're so used to in seeing for ships of the scale. The addition of small cannons along the side of the hull is another interesting detail. The huge sails give the ship a grand scale, ensuring it towers over the ocean waves below. And below that we have, a, on the bottom of page 66, we have a tips to take from this build with a book symbol and background green. And it reads, go back to old builds and prove them with additional features like cannons. My, my, why, what a creative and exciting project that would be. Have a previously built ship and to edit it. So it has more of a design like a pirate ship with cannons. A thrilling, thrilling project to undergo in Minecraft, I do, I must say. So there we have it. That is the end of our reading for today. Tune in next time. We'll be reading pages 68 
to page 73, how to build an epic roller coaster. I think you want to tune in for that episode because we're going to do some actual building in, in that reading. <clears throat> Pardon me for a moment. <clears throat> Thank you for watching. I am Professor <clears throat> Jerome. <clears throat> Book reader, my mustache seems to be having having a mind of its own right now. And you've been watching Video Game as Oasis presents Handbook Re Video Game Handbook Reading with Professor Jerome. Thank you for watching. If you have if you like what you've seen here, please like this video, add it to your favorites in the comments below, share. Share with your friends on Facebook, Twitter, all the social media websites you use. Subscribe to Video Gamers Oasis on YouTube. Click the notification bell as well as follow me on this channel, on this Twitch channel, Video Gamers Oasis. Thank you for watching. I bid you adieu and have a splendid weekend and even more adventurous and exciting week ahead. Video Game Handbook Reading with Professor Jerome. Hi, this is Jeremy from Video Gamers Oasis speaking. Make sure to follow my Twitch channel, https colon forward slash forward slash triple w dot twitch dot tv forward slash video gamers oasis and chat with me while I'm streaming. I would appreciate your company while I play some more fun games like this one and engage in some enjoyable gamer and geek discussions. See you there! Video Gamers Oasis Website YouTube Channel